welcome to Derek's World of Motorcycling. Today, I'm on my way to Huggy's Speed Shop in Kirby Mallory for another of its famed old-timer classic car and bike meets. It's also a good opportunity to put some miles on my Kawasaki S2A following its top-end engine rebuild.
Right, so it's a 1950... 59, two door, 600 limousine. 600 limousine. Jetta. So it's a boxer twin engine round the back. Mm. And how long have you had it? We've only had it four years. Did you do the restoration? Did you, is this no, how you got the car? No, all the paint work and that was all done. All I've done is upgraded some of the uh, things that it needed doing. I presume it's not a UK car. No, no, this right. is this is made in Germany and they only made 30,000 and most of them were left over in Germany and East European and then quite a few went to America. But that was never introduced here because the Mini had come out then and which killed the bubble cars anyway because it, these were dearer than the Mini. Garage 25 years, I haven't used it. What do you want for you? It says, what do you reckon? So I said, how about 100 quid? He said, oh, I want a bit more than that. I said, what about 150? He said, okay, then I'll have it. You can have it for 150 quid. It was absolutely like rust everywhere. Wasn't it? The frame was terrible, the back of the was hanging off. Did the engine turn over? No out? key, it was like, the engine turned over and I got it going, but it sounded like the bag of nails. So, stripped it all down. The guy who was in the Bantam Club was a, a welder all his life, and he uh, welded it all up for me with no panel. And I, I bought new exhaust, leg shields. Yeah, the envelopes I got off eBay, they're not original, but I just like them, so I put them on. Yeah. So, seat recovered. The wheels are off eBay, like from China, but they're really good quality. Yeah. And, um, New head bearings, new brakes. I bought a new barrel and piston on it and a new clutch and timing chain. And um, new lights, indicators. And then that's it. It wasn't like going to be a, a full restoration. I oh. just, just wanted to like just get it back on the road, really. I'd never rode one before, and it was a learning curve how to ride it, and I oh. really took to it. Yeah. And I've joined the, um, the moped club. <laughs> and we, we've just had a ride out this morning and came here at uh, Huggies. Mm. So oh, lovely. That was nice. <laughs>